Are you trying to be a hot girl, but your outfit looks a mess? Your friends are ready to go out, and now you in distress. You wanna look nice, but you working with less. Well, look no further. I'ma show you how to go from not to hot with this DIY custom T-shirt. <laughs> For this project, you will need a t-shirt, some parchment paper, cling wrap, a canvas, some scissors, an iron, and of course, your images. So first things first, you wanna get your t-shirt on a hard, smooth surface. Then you wanna take your canvas or your textbook, whatever you have, and put it into your t-shirt to separate the two layers. Next. You want to take your image of choice, mine is Megan Stallion, and put it onto some cling wrap and wrap the entire image front to back in your cling wrap. And I didn't speed up this clip because I wanted you guys to see how careful you have to be with wrapping your image in the cling wrap so that it transfers clearly and perfectly onto your t-shirt the way you desire it. So after you're done wrapping your image in the cling wrap, you want to take some parchment paper and cut it to about the size of your image. What the parchment paper does is acts as a barrier between the iron and the image to get it to transfer onto your t-shirt. Next, what you want to do is take your iron and smooth it over the parchment paper, making sure you're going really slow and really carefully. Another thing you want to do is make sure that your iron is on the highest heat possible. And I'm not going to lie, I barely iron my clothes. So I have a very old school iron, but if you have one of those high tech irons, you want to make sure it's on the highest heat. Even if you burn the parchment paper a little bit, it will make the image transfer so much better. After you think you've got the image pressed on the t-shirt enough, paying special attention to those four corners, you can go ahead and peel off the parchment paper and voila, you have yourself a custom print t-shirt. And bam, instant hot girl and another DIY completed. Don't forget to like and subscribe and DIY is worth a try. See you next time.